Hello all, welcome to this session. In this session, I'm going to answer one of the Selenium interview questions. That is how to work with a radio button in Selenium WebDriver. Let me answer. In Selenium WebDriver, we can work with a radio button using some commands like click. Using this click command, we can select a radio button. And using the is selected command, we can check whether the radio button is in selected state or not. So these are the two commands that we can use to work with a radio button. Let me practically demonstrate these two commands for you. For that, I'll switch to this Eclipse IDE where we have the sample Selenium automation code, which is already written for opening the Chrome browser, for maximizing the browser. Here we need to open the application URL. I'll take you to the sample application that is omai.blogspot.com. So I'll copy this URL and paste it here. And here you have a radio button, okay? So first I want to see, or here also we have some radio buttons, okay? First I want to see whether I can select this radio button or not. I would like to select this, uh, let's say out of male, female, I would like to select male, okay? Male radio button, I would like to select. Inspect this male radio button and it has an ID, copy this ID. What command we have to use to select this radio button? Dot, direct dot click command, okay? Simply write down driver dot, find element by dot ID, okay? By dot ID and provide the ID locator of that radio button and say dot click. Now this command is going to select the radio option. You see before running, mail option is not selected. And now after running, you will see that the mail option will get selected, okay? So this is a mail radio button. Okay, done. So fine, it is done. Then one more command is also there to see whether the radio button is in selected state or not. So how to check that whether the particular radio button is in selected state. For example, here we have multiple radio buttons. Bike is in not selected state, whereas bicycle radio button is in selected state. Car is in not selected state. Let's find it out how to use this command to see whether this radio button is in not selected state and this radio button is in selected state. Okay, further I'll again switch to this Eclipse ID and here I'll remove this line. Application is same. So what I will do here is uh, I'll simply right click on this bike uh, radio button which is not in currently not in selected state. And uh, what I can do is a value bike is there, input uh, value bike is there. I'll copy this. I'll create an XPath expression out of this. Control F slash input at the rate value is equal to bike like this i'll give to locate the bike radio button only one element is getting located copy this and create web element driver dot find element by dot x path and uh here give the x path expression of that bike radio button so bike radio element okay button element okay so hold the mouse and say create local variable the return type of the find element which is web element will come here now i want to see whether this radio button is in selected state or not if bike this element bike radio element dot e selected this is a command guys okay that we can use this will return true if this radio button is in selected state okay system dot out dot radial and in that case i will say radio button radio button is in selected state okay otherwise if this e selected returns false when this radio button is not in selected state it will return false and will go to the else block where I'll print it out saying system dot out dot print and radio button is not in selected state. Okay. And finally, I'll quit the browser guys. Okay. Now, what should be printed in the output? Radio button is not in selected state, should be printed in the output console. Let's see the output. What should be printed? Radio button is not in selected state. You see, radio button is not in selected state got printed. Now, what I will do is I'll take the another radio button, bicycle radio button, inspect this. Okay, here uh, we got this bicycle. Copy this bicycle value and replace this bike with bicycle. It will locate the bicycle radio button got located, which is in currently in selected state. This XPath expression, I'll copy here and go back to this and replace this bike uh, XPath expression with bicycle XPath expression and here, Instead of a uh, bike, I'll write a uh, bicycle radio button and I'll copy this and say bicycle radio button dot is selected. In this case, what should be printed? Radio button is in selected state should be printed because bicycle radio button is in selected state on the application.
So I have run the code and in the output we should get radio button is in selected state. So this is how we can work, okay, with the radio buttons in Selenium. You see, radio button is in selected state got printed. So hope guys, you got the answer for this question. So that's all for this session. Thank you. Bye-bye.